Here's a really quick demonstration app to show you how to update photos. In the media section, I have uploaded one, two, three, four, five, six photos, which are die1.png, die2.png, and so on, and then a sound file called roll.wave. And what's going to happen when you click the roll button is the computer is randomly going to choose a number between one and six, and then show the the photo with that number on it, and at the same time play the roll sound. So here's what it looks like when I run it. You can hear the dice sound, and it randomly chooses a photo to show. So we rolled a two, we rolled a two, we rolled three twos in a row. Sometimes you get the same numbers in the row, sometimes you won't. That's randomness. Um, so every time you push the button, you get a roll. How does it work? Well, you can see we have a button, we have a single image. Now, this is the place where the image is displayed on the screen, and so that's an image. And then down here in the media section, we have the different files that we can display in that image, and we have the sound. Looking in the blocks editor, when the roll button is clicked, we play sound one, which in the designer, we told sound one what its source would be. And then we do this procedure, which I've called update die photo. And to update a die photo, I do, the first thing is to, to work, work up the file name, which is the word die, followed by some random number between one and six, followed by PNG. So it might be die1.png, die2.png, die6.png, or anywhere in the middle. And then, whatever the name we chose, we put that name in the dieimage.picture. So if you have an app that has, a, I like to think of this as a picture frame, it's, it's, a, it's an image, and then you can put any photo in that picture frame from the media that you have selected just by putting a text block with the name of the file in the set this thing's picture 2 block.